Hello everybody, we are going to be playing a bit more of Dark Souls today, so hopefully we can uh, pick up our pieces of, well our souls, sorry, from our body next to the armors. So right now, obviously, if, if you just uh, click on this first, I'd recommend watching the first video. Have, have yesterday, um, which is the beginning, it will clue up whereabouts we are. Uh, just going to pick up some pieces around here, I may as well whilst we're here. We've got to talk to the cleric as well for stuff, and we can also go and talk to a little sneaky, sneaky spot down here, in case you didn't know. By the Lord, your face. <laughs> your humanity is really slipping, but there are methods. Most fools have more humanity than they know what to do with. Now, who do you imagine will make the best use of it? So we're going to use that Firekeeper Sword, that, that big guy was guarding. We're going to use that to upgrade our um, even our Estus of Flasks. You can see now it's got a plus one. So now we are going to run up here. We've still got our club. We're going to be rocking the club still for a while. Let's talk to our boy. Hello there. Hello. I realize that I have requested that we retain our distance. But I also want you to know that it is not meant in ill will. Here. Take this as a token of peace. No, go ahead. It's for you. I believe you can use these as. Well, I don't know if it's those points. Oh, oh but, I know. How uh, about this? You can this? use it to boost your life to, to find items and stuff, unless it's here nice. anyway. So, what if I were to teach you some miracles? Would that please you? Very well. Covenant with gods. There we go, we're part of our first covenant. Now, only their ultimate effectiveness will be determined by your efforts and your faith. Companions, she is young. We are. Yeah. Anyway, basically, you get miracles, which are a lot. They're non-offensive. They don't do a lot of damage. You get like force. Um, we're just gonna go sneak to a sneaky area. You get like um, force, which pushes enemies back or players as well. If you're uh, playing PvP, it's pretty good. Um, I don't really use miracles. Oh, my bones. Morgan Star and a Talos Man. Oh, crap. Cracked red eye orbs. Alright, uh, now we're here. We're gonna jump down. This is where the skeletons live. Oh, there we go. Good bash. Probably rate right, this is probably one of the better weapons to use against them. So just great uh, because they're because these character types, these models, as you hit them they break apart. Whereas if you use a like a weapon of slash, you can literally just slash it. There we go, we got with WHAM! Yeah. Cool. Oh, we go. These are the little animations your character can do. We're just going to do a shrug. <laughs> well, <laughs> backstab after backstab. Hmm. Right, now this is where we're it's a big boy. Now 
time we kill the big boys, we've got. I do think we're going to die by a big sword. I think we've only had one death as well, as far as I'm aware. It's way hander. It's way hander. Big old two sword. Uh, two handed sword. And that's that. I think we've got the loot. We're not going to go any further into the caves. We'll have a look at that later. Oh, it's another boy. change it a filthy animal. Mm -hmm. Right, and now we're gonna go back up here. I'm gonna deal with all those guys again, because they do they definitely spawn back. Yeah they all are. Mm -hmm. yeah. Said I was just going to try and get the souls, but that's in the boss room, I believe. So it is literally just running and try and do some whackage. As far as we can over here, 
souls and then after we're gonna have a hefty um, count that we can level up with and we'll probably get some more armor as we go as well I could try it with a, a shield but I'm gonna stick it out with this um, club I believe this club's gonna take me far we'll have weapons that we got anyway wing spear that we just picked up in the graveyard we also picked up that, which uh, we can't use, but it's a axe. Pretty cool. And it boosts your, uh, boosts your uh, resistance as well, which is pretty cool. Uh, clever one, are we? Not too clever, Potter. Shield keeps the shield up. I know it was a dumb idea to keep on going, so we've lost a lot of money, by the way. Uh, gargoyles, gargoyles, but we took a risk. We're going to try and keep fighting those bolder knights, uh, try and get some better armor, and if we can, get one of our straight swords because they are banging. name of progression we will carry on. We'll get this. I can promise that. Going up. I'll go with that. You know, it doesn't save us too often. Can we still roll? I didn't say I was going to keep on going with the old club. Look at that amount of damage. Go in and we're gonna go and kill the gargoyles this time. 
this is the time I'm going to do it. leads up to the first bell, so we are done with the first objective, or one half of the objective. Okay. All that is... Oh, so the next boss is double, double gargoyles again in here. fall down here because I don't want to climb this ladder again. You'll be happy to hear as well if you haven't played any of the uh, other games. You can actually slide down the ladders. Which is great. You just fly down them. You can go up them quicker. You know, use the stamina. I'm climbing up. Going down is fine. Oh! This guy. Does he look dodgy? <laughs> no. We'll do we'll do business. There you go. I am Oswald of Kareem. The pardoner. Come oh, on, oh, keep skipping it. For indeed all sin is my domain. Not sin. Sell some stuff, but look at the price on that 40,000. Temporary auto counter burst heavy damage. And he sells rings poison ring, which is 15,000, which is a lot. I don't think we need any of this. Well, that is just well, what is it? It's going to take us a while to get back to our main base, so we'll double that. Using the homeward bow. Now I said I would have like decks, but we've got a good 
reason for it. Maybe we can two hand it now. So, what's the stats for? 80. Close enough. Okay, so now we've rang a bell. We're going to go back up to the main area. We're going to kill some more bomb at night to get some more uh, mourner, some more blue luck. Hopefully get some armor, because our guy's looking horrible. I need to cover up this body as much as we can. I'm not going all the way up, am I? to find this boy here. Look at that! Professionalism. He's walking over. Oh, there we go. You saw your friend die. Be intimidated. The leaps. The majestic leaps, see? They're powerless. Right, definitely we're not going to be able to roll well. So we'll get rid of gauntlets. No. Okay. We have the same roll through. Builds in our guys' uh, look now. So you lure them, you lure them into the lunch, and you whack them. No, you trousers. I was hoping that we could um, lower him up here. This is the other one that's down there. But I didn't hear it running. Nice. Dark Root Fjord. 
Oh, there's another one. I forgot we can't dodge anymore. You know the blacksmith from last episode that you could buy a um, crest of the Tories? Um, you open this door using that. Secrets. Doors. Uh, open up. Bonfires. Here we go. Get ready, because you might see this place a lot. you didn't know, this is a trap. You can see ahead of us that there is a snake. And it's dead. I think that's the only one in this as well. You don't see any more snakes. Now we have these heavy boys. Very slow. But if they hit you, you'll fucking hurt. And he's dead. Two hits. 600 souls per enemy. He's using this spell, we might get caught in it, no, we got out. But uh, in an aura around him now, you get close to it, you uh, get caught. And you can't do very quick, or roll. Like so, yeah, there you go. I'm showing you, obviously, as an example. But it goes away. Get around and get away. Let's go grab that. And now we're going to get ready to deal with the other one. Ooh, some healing items. There we go. Still better to use that and all that. It's better anyway. It's better anyway. Okay, we're going to embrace it now. We can't move very quick. Yeah. <clears throat> Still got it. Ah! We got hit, I'm pretty sure, by every one of them. Rock 
of that. And E. Now this is the guy I'm worried about. We caught him. Just before he could use it. Another snake here. Got it. I'll take that. I believe there's one more knife point. There he is. Okay, we got it. Now. There's a boss ahead. <clears throat> but I am going to go back to for a secret path. You guys might have saw the tree that's uh, coloured strange to everything else. This boy, and it's actually alive. Can't hurt you. You have to beat them. Life out of it. Let me in. Souls it gives. I think it's like a hundred. Today. Nice. That's an idea. Right. They're all slow. Roll back into it, and almost roll back into it again. Get it. These aren't hostile, there you go. We're not just killing them out of fun. Oh. Ow. Go on, heat. Oh. Oh. Green Blossom, use that to uh, increase your stamina uh, regeneration. So if I die for that, it'll come back quick. There won't be as much of a delay. Oh, Ooh, we nearly died there. A bit, you can jump, right? You're right. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah, we've been playing games before where you can actually uh, jump. Dark Souls, this one, you can jump. But you hold the B button down and then you quickly tap to jump. And I completely uh, forgot. Because the controls in the other two games is you're running and you press the left, or hold B down as you're running, like so. 
and you press the left stick down and your character will jump. Rather than this, just hold B and tap B after a quick, uh, quick succession. Or succession. Can't remember how you say it. Yeah, and then you jump, so six grand, that's fine. Just have to go back and get it. Deal with this guy. I think that's all the lizard boys as well. The frog boys. Oh, we killed them at the time, two hits. Right. We ain't gonna do this again. <coughs> that's for sure. Those trees. I don't care. Not about well, these two anyway. Uh, into the abyss. There you go. Yeah, that's it. They know where they're falling. Hopefully, we can now use. We can use it. Set people. We have finally got the Dark Knight. Dark Knight? Yeah, Black Knight Sword, that's it. So it's very heavy. I'm gonna get rid of this. Oh, we can see. Oh! We can use this. So, let's get going. Let's just show off the damage on this bad boy. That's fine. We'll, we'll get that. We'll get that. Kind of got bad, but that tree just snuck up, right? We missed that guy twice. Two obvious hits, just missed him. Um, but it's fine. We'll get that. Too. Wait till we can actually hit something, right? Maybe this guy. Look at that big damage. Now, I can use this one hand, but damage wise, it's better to use uh, two hand. Oh, we're in a bad situation. Oh, we're in a very bad situation. Yes. As soon as you're used to that and he's got us cornered, um, basically you're just going to be walking over to him and he's going to have all that speed. We'll actually have to pace to that. Uh, just check what it's Big slash. Cool. Ooh, it's a stab, one hand. A more slashy as well. Got him. Look at that bad. Okay, and now we'll go into here. And well, okay, we're definitely going to keep going for a while. We can't be dealing with that. I can also block with this, right? I forgot to mention, you can block with your weapon, but it doesn't do a great deal of damage. Well, uh, no. so that's not good. Okay, because he's using that, we'll try and throw some stuff over at him. So. Oh, Let's get in there. Finish him. Heavy hit. One hit. I think we can go with the fireball anyway, but you know, we'll just that's what I'm talking about. Okay, uh, now we have one over here. Okay, 
in the back of the leg. Tell you what, this is a good spot to farm uh, souls from. And now, we're going to get into the next bo uh, box, boss, which is the Moonlight Butterfly. Get ready, it's the flying boss. There it is over there, you see it, big boy. And now we're going to take it on. do this. I have complete and utter faith. Just gonna run by these, try and keep as much healing items as we can. This time we're going to fill the armor up when we get to the bridge, um, and we're just going to try and tank the damage. We haven't got a lot of health, so I've been upgrading it. Probably should do now that I've got this, but we'll um, give it another attempt. Please, please, just leave me alone. I don't want anything to do with you guys. Wouldn't 
shields us all better, all better, much better against magic. We can't really roll, but we'll take this. So fast. Steps. 
Sub boss, sub boss. The Hydra, which you'll see in a minute. Well, probably not a bit ever. Soon. Dark Root Bison. Probably take on the other Black Knight, you know, now. If we can try and get the Great Sword. If we get that, then that's what we'll be using pretty much in the game. And we can upgrade our sword. He's still following. There he is as well. No, 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 you've come all this way, you may as well try and do this circle. Try and dive. Oh, he's following us all the way down. He's a, a true hero. Ooh, we've got some leather clothing. Doesn't weigh as much. Uh. Fine. Get rid of that. We roll that. Um, get rid of the ring. Does the ring? I don't think the rings weigh anything on this. No, they don't. It's uh, annoying. Here we go. This glaze pretty good as well. <laughs> Backstab. Yeah, not so tough now, are you? Oh, what's it got? One of your weapons. Two hits. A backstab and a big old swing. This shield is a good shield to have. Not to use as, as a shield, but it gives you a stamina recovery boost. So you can just keep on your back and keep swinging with this bad boy. Think from this point. going to use humanity. Now I'll show you another thing you can do, and it'll be a good one to do from this point. So, you can use humanity. I'm going to use one. So that we have two. I'm going to reverse all of it, so we become human. Cool baits, cool baits. And after, we're going to kindle. Now what this does, is it allows the bonfire to produce more Estus flasks that you can take from this bonfire itself. So, can't make. The one that we're just outside the big door, but we need the, uh, it says locked by contraption, the one that you need the Crest of the Tories for. Um, that one will only give you five if you went there to recover some, whereas this will give you ten. Now, we could go down that way, but I'll leave that for another episode. Right now, we're going to try and kill Havel. Just over there in the distance. There you can see you can see it moving. We'll tackle that. We'll probably not for a while. Since uh, quite an annoying boss to little sub boss to take on. Here, we'll take on Havel. Hello. There he is. Big old Havel. We've got a good meaty hit on him there. Back up! Yeah! That thing, generally, that hits me now, I reckon. Very heavy. I think it's like set damage on uh, about being upgraded. It's like 300 maybe? Got rid of it. I wasn't actually expecting it to be that easy. So, now that we equip this ring, it boosts our maximum equipment load, so we can probably wear all this now. And uh, okay, I'm guessing if you wear clothes, it Oh, no, it 
does. Okay, so we can wear some heavier uh, gloves, and we can still do our full roll. So that's a bit there. Just gonna climb this tower. This should take us back to the die of the barrel. Get out, see, look at these puny enemies now. They don't mean anything. Look at that. What? One hit, and they're, they're shaking. I'm shaking! Good effort, champs. You ain't nothing for the naked boy. Firebomb. It's always good to have more firebombs. Uh. go to this point here, and we'll probably end up this episode, this part, we've leveled up maybe our endurance, so we can wear more stuff, it's, uh, I think it used to have a percentage, oh, it's not got a percentage, it's got an actual equipment load, I think it's if you keep it below 20, maybe? Oh. Yeah, we can wear boots now. There we go. We're not that much of a sin. Okay, but again, thank you for watching. If you haven't done so already and you want to stay notified on my videos uh, as I produce a lot, or well, I'm hoping to produce a lot of gaming videos. Obviously, I'm carrying on with Dark Souls. This will be the first game I'll probably finish uh, just to play through. Just one single playthrough, and then I will probably be moving on to some other stuff which I'll get in contact with you guys through my socials. Um, subscribe if you haven't done so already, it helps with the channel as we uh, try to progress onwards and produce more content for you guys at the end of the day to watch. So, thank you for watching and take care, everybody. Deuces. Deuces. <sighs>